Mitzvah Sira Hashem the Limuda. Name is Ayira the Tibios Tibiosera, inner meaning of Yira and its natures. Fakdam of the Mesefim of Sira Hashem, Kasa Bachosi Zal, and Paul writes, I think actually today might be his Yotzai, there somewhere. Shen Yonim Adinonim Besifro, that uh, the matters which are discussed in the Sefer, Amitosam Gruyelakol. Everybody knows that they're true. Ella, Shenishkochim Beteva Haragel, they are forgotten because of the nature of our habits. Shall uh, Pirsumam, no, not our habits. The habits of Shopris Mam Shidusam, since they are so well known and so um that so simple, they're hiding in plain sight. And people don't recall them. Everybody who knows the concepts of Yira Abba and Vekus. Have idea Rakidia Sashem Levado. But the our idea is only knowing the name of these concepts. And not the intent that the name carries it within itself. In other words, the concepts are independent of the content thereof. We know the concepts. We don't know the contents. Because according to the Kedusha of the depth of the Chochma Vira, all of uh, uh, Achonos is, all other Chochma are just um, um, Preparations, uh, just uh, uh, introduction preparations for it. It's um, uh, let's say the Gerus Rambam, but the uh, uh, the um, I think it's learned from uh, Rashi's Chachma Yeras Hashem that uh, the Rashi's Chachma here meaning not the beginning, but rather the purpose of Chachma. Lo Yivadu La Dami Tzad. The Mitzvah Shosharim says the Mitzvah Shosharim says Hein Yeras Hashem Yichol. Right. Okay, right. So lo 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 you can't just speaking about them externally is not going to make them know to you. I'll be going to lay, but it has to do with the uh, 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 thoughts of the heart, the burp nimi in inner speech. This is the, the reason why they're so hidden. It's so many people, even the wise men who are accustomed to uh, knowledge wisdom. Which most of the world, there's no difference between content and 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 uh, and concept. Uh, the the content concept are the, uh, flip sides of the same coin. Most when you speak about them, you Just by speaking about them, you can recognize the value of their depths. And the compelling necessity to um, to to uh, focus on them until you know them well. It's not possible for anybody who possesses intellect. Person can't think he knows them unless he actually knows them. Or you can't say you know biology unless you know biology. You can't say you know physics unless you know physics. Most of the things which have to do with the heart. They're not just simple, not just facts. The Omega in things which have to do with the heart as opposed to the mind, there uh, you can't get that um, uh, with the, the or just using the terms. Because it's not there is no uh, basis in language to speak about all the manners of understanding which are necessary. In other words, the the, the language of the heart is not well uh, conveyed in words. Uh, somebody who doesn't uh, analyze the until he uh, completely um, verifies these matters, so thinks he knows just because he knows the concepts. So we have to understand them with an inner of uh, uh, understanding. And then uh, once you know that inner understanding, then things will expand by you. So you need that recognition. So comes also to the point 
How you possess Yira, you will be able to impart it to others. Oh, the other concept as well. Why is it that these concepts are uh, are evident to everybody? Naturally. Because all matters of the obligations of the heart and its purification, the Ziku kind of portions, refining souls, and, uh, and all the details of the Midos, the uh, Mitsoyim Baza All uh, uh, all Midos, including Midos of Avodah Hashem, are natures for a person. Same claim as That's these are the tools by which he lives his life. These are these these are natural forces within the human psyche. They're in the soul of Eretz Yisrael, mechad shal mitzara. So we don't have to uh, uh, be mechadish them. They're there. Like to echla losa, have to uplift them. She olchim al derech dovish to go in a positive way. She kulam panim al Hashem isbar. They should all turn towards Hashem. She tachlis kol tikva, which is the purpose of every hope. Kol chachma b'zeh he rak lo abim. Chachma, this is only to understand. Ech yu kon yana midos notim al Hashem isbar v'shem kvodo. How all the midos can be inclined towards Hashem. His honor. So the names don't really uh, 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 capture the chachma, which is necessary for the sabayda, because uh, the names, the concepts are not don't talk, don't express the midos. These don't uh, um, give an uh, indication of how, how these midos should be developed. Nevertheless, they're not something separate from the from the uh, concepts. Um, uh, and for great purpose, Hashem put these uh, kochos within us. Because the true uh, uh, focus or the direction for serving Hashem constantly should never be something which is uh, removed from a person, even for a moment. But uh, 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 anything which is uh, which you've acquired, which is not embedded in your soul, it's very easy to lose. Very hard to uh, keep it all the time. It, it, your soul is your soul. Whatever is embedded in your soul is embedded in your soul, and it's there, and it's going to remain there. But anything which is, whether it's Ruchnius or Gashmius or anything of that sort, which is not embedded in your soul, it's very easy to lose, because it's not intrinsic to who we are, it's extrinsic to who we are. Um, that, uh, uh, in order to make these things easier for us, made all these midos intrinsic to us. And when a person is able to be intelligent enough to uplift them, it just goes in the pathways of Hashem. They can be not just in his uh, nature, which is his uh, his. Uh, his poten po potential, but also uh, uh, in, in, in a conscious way, in his heart. It's like they're embedded in nature before they come. Presentation before they come to a person's awareness. So this we have a place which we can learn. How necessary how it is for a person to be diligent. Knowing Hashem by Nagasa Shlema in his uh, uh, perfect conduct, but Tuvo, but Chazdo Hamufla, and his wonderful goodness, his wonderful kindness. So, Rekol Chetzenu, all of our desire, Sheela Midos, She includes the all the Mazinos which are part of our nature, Ain Bats Mom, they themselves, Kashay's Barlon, Sheikh Shoy, Lishtam Hashem, who are Buddhist Hashem is Bark, the primary there for serve Hashem, who close with Zer, they'll be. Kavua, and this, I, I'm not sure what it means by that. Presumably, it means in a, in a conscious way, as opposed to just being um, there. They, uh, I assume, it means that they're actually be uh, used for this purpose. And that's what he calls Vekos. Interesting that the Midos are Dovuk in the Nefesh. They're always Dovuk in the Nefesh. That's the Teva. Once you put them in the realm of Das, which is not just Teva, but awareness, uh, to bring them close to Hashem, you tell me the Imo Yisbarach. 
Yeah, you can always be with our Kodesh Baruch Hu. So the meat of Dveikus, he's saying, he's saying two things here. He's saying there's a mile of Dveikus, that the, uh, uh, that the meat of Sardvukos ben Nefesh always. But that's not here Dveikus in a Kodesh Baruch Hu. That's Dveikus in yourself, in your own meat of. Then if a person puts them into his das, then he can achieve Dveikus with Hashem. Okay. But you can't put them in a situation which is not their first nature. And so I with means, which were insufficient even for the first nature. Okay, I'll see what he means by that. Beard Vart. Our main way we see, Shamidos and Timis Bazam, the natural means of a person, Ainanik Vos Kim with Fiadas. They are embedded in him. Conscious way, according to his das. He also, based on his das, ben shetamitis o kozeves, which could be true or false. That could be daiso. To that extent, his midos will uh, will be um, will cling to him. A child who's very very little, who doesn't recognize anything at all. He has no midos. She is out. Just a second. I'll call you back in a minute. Okay. Okay. My, my Chabrusa, I'm, I'm sorry I got here late tonight, but uh, hopefully this will pass. So um, he says, um, He doesn't have meters at all. Okay, he knows food. He has food. If somebody takes him, he's going to get angry. So already he got the anger. The first me does anger, right? And more of us again. So he says, you know, you have to grow up in knowing your meadows and, and using it the right way. Shalpin is going to know meadows. That which you lack, that's keep like you flying the airco, double and double that. You excite my meadows, the lack for meadows. Came with you, so rich, lohen, because that is this root for them, no son, and uplifts them. So basically, what we learned tonight is that the, there are everybody has meadows which are necessary in order to accomplish the vacus, and they're dovic in the nevish of a person, so a person has an intrinsic connection to them, but uh, they need das in order to develop them, and otherwise, they're on their own. They can, they're never going to get anywhere. Okay. Yes. So, Very good. Right? Okay, Mr. Shem, next week again. So far, he's not unintelligible. See what happens. <laughs> okay. Okay. Have a good night. Very good. Have a good night. You too.